Arts and Entertainment for the Burlington Free Press. I started working for the Free Press in 1999. I was covering news, education in particular. Whenever I got the chance, I would sneak in and write about bands that were coming to town or you know something artistic going on in town. In 2004, they created Arts and Entertainment writer position and boom, it was like, yeah, that's what I want. I'm really, really fascinated by the creative process, why people need to create, because 90% of people here are not making a living at the art they do. Uh, so it's like, why do it? Like, what motivates you to not get paid, to, you know, do a lot of work for your art? So just kind of getting into the psychology of art to a degree really interests me a lot. I tell people I have the best job in Vermont because I get to go to plays, go to concerts, talk to amazingly creative and interesting people who, by the very nature of what they do, are good at expressing what they do. You know, I've covered Fish's final concert in Coventry in the mud in 2004, which turned out not to be their final concert. You know, I've watched musicians like Grace Potter and Ananias Mitchell and several others develop. There's a lot of satisfaction, especially having done it now for 12 years, of watching the progress that people make, and that really excites me. Once I was in college, I knew what I wanted to be was an arts writer. You know, in college, for any project I had, I would be interviewing bands and kind of insinuate myself into that line of work. I spend a lot of time at venues, and you know, what I write about is also something I do as a hobby. I find myself at concerts even when I'm not working, just, you know, because that, that's what excites me.